Tommy, what's your uh, assessment of that game today? Uh, obviously disappointed we didn't win the game, but overall uh, I don't think we did enough to win the game. Started extremely well, get that early goal, but it's criminal to concede so early after after going ahead, and it's a poor goal from our point of view. We're, we're far too deep, um, and then it was you know it was a bit of a scrappy you know first half. We couldn't really get our foot in the ball and, and pass it as like we normally do. We couldn't get you know Berkey in the game um, as much as we'd liked, and we've we've managed to get a goal basically out of nothing and. Um, well, that, you know, that should give us a lift. It, it, it didn't really, and, and Ross County always looked a threat with balls into our box. Um, so, start the second half wasn't the start we wanted because Ross County were on the front foot, and winning second ball, putting bo dangerous balls in our box, and eventually we concede, um, and it goes to two each up. And it wasn't really until the last 20, 25 minutes that I thought we'd get any control in the game, uh, when the game opened up a little bit. They maybe sat a little bit deeper, thinking that possibly you know a good a point here is um, you know what they w would be happy with that, um, and we have the best opportunities in the last twenty minutes. But um, keeper makes a good save, Greg does okay, and um, we get in behind them three or four times, but don't just the final ball let us down. Um, I kind of no complaints, you know, uh, with result. Even though Zach is pushed for the for the equaliser. Um, but uh, I think Ross County deserved a point and I, th I think a point was probably all we deserved out of the game and, and the players are disappointed because they they didn't show today uh, for periods of the game the energy and the quality that they've shown me in, uh, in recent weeks so um, to say that we haven't played well and got a point we've got to be reasonably happy with that. When you saw their team, you kind of mentioned that it looked that we were going for a kind of physical approach. Do you feel that's how it played out, that they went for that kind of getting balls in the box to try and unsettle our, our team? Yeah, I think it was. They put the ball in from deep a lot. They put it in from the halfway line a lot. We probably get sucked into that a little bit in, in, in terms of when we had possession, particularly in the first half and went long too often. Um, you know, it's not how we set up the play, but sometimes in games, you know, uh, that's what happens and players get sucked into, you know, not doing the things that they've worked on during the week. Um, so it, it, it was it was physical. We, If you look at it, their two goals, you know, um, obviously we get one off a set play, but their two goals come from a, a set play and, you know, a long, uh, a long ball into our box. Is it pleasing after Kyle getting a lot of the plaudits in recent weeks for rightly for his goals that the two wingers contributed as well and just shooting yeah. the goals about? I mean, and with four different scores against Mullerwell. Um, so that's important going into these last four games in the league. And, um, you know, the thing today was, you know, nothing was going to be decided today. And it's almost regarding us in Ross County as, uh, you know, as you were. Um, we know that. We just need to get one more point in Ross County in in these last four games, and if we do that, with our goal difference, that will you know we'll we'll get that tenth spot.